Every year, there's that one small budget film that gets mainstream attention. Last year, it was Slumdog Millionaire. This year, that film is undoubtedly precious. Welcome back to our inside look at the story behind the film. You know, it's hard to believe that Precious was Gabby Sidibe's first foray into acting. We found out that a couple of Hollywood heavyweights played a part in her nabbing the role. My name is Clarice Precious Jones. It's hard to imagine anyone other than Gabby Sidibe in the title role of Precious. I started by calling Hollywood agents, and, 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 and you just can't call a Hollywood agent and say, hey, you got a 450 pound black girl. They don't exist. Producers looked everywhere for the right actress, but came up empty. So I found myself having open calls. It just as I picked the girl, Gabby came in. At the time, Gabby was a student who had little interest in show business. And a friend of mine who I act with at Lehman College called me and told me that Precious was coming to cast. And he thought that I kind of fit what they were looking for. And I was like, really? Because I'm not an actress. When the time came for her full audition, she almost blew it off. And when I left the house the next day, I still didn't know where I was going. Because it's I, I would have had to cut class in order to, to go to the audition. It was either go downtown to class or go uptown to the audition. Then fate intervened in the form of the cast and crew of American Gangster. It's so funny, American Gangster, <laughs> the Denzel Washington film, was shooting in my neighborhood and happened to be shooting on the downtown side of the street. So I had to cross the street and go uptown. And so just because I was on the uptown side of the street, I went to the audition. TV Guide has exclusive footage of Gabby's audition. I'm tired, Miss Payne. I know you are, but you can't stop now. You gotta fight through this. You still have to live your life and do the best you can with the hand you've been dealt. If not for yourself, then for the people who love you. That's a lie. Nobody loved me. And the rest, as they say, is history. For more behind the scenes scoop on the making of the film, look for Precious on Blu-ray and DVD starting March 9th. Still ahead, a private screening of Precious ignites one star's journey into self-discovery. Welcome back to TV Guide's exclusive look behind the film Precious. Recently, the film's distributor Lionsgate Entertainment held a private screening with special guest star China Lane. Although the story of Precious is fictional, the premise hit an emotional chord with the actress and the other special attendees. My name is Rhonda Patrice Johnson. I was born in Kingston, Jamaica. In Precious, China Lane plays a no-nonsense Jamaican immigrant working to get her GED. She's a, such a strong person because she, like many of the characters in the film, has overcome such hardships. John, you're late. Rhonda, you ain't the teacher. This story was unlike any other story that has ever been told. Nothing done nothing for me. Love beat me. That wasn't love, Precious. There is a little girl, there's a little boy out there who their stories and their lives have been pushed to the sidelines for way too long and swept under a rug. And this film did not apologize in saying, you need to wake up and pay attention to this person. And if you are this person, it's okay to talk about it. How are you? And with this message in mind, Lionsgate Entertainment and China hosted a screening of the film for the Downtown Women's Center of Los Angeles. At the start of the show, a surprise message from the film star. Hi, it's Gabby. So glad that you all are able to attend. The women, many of whose lives parallel Precious's story, approached the film with anticipation. I hope that women of all ages and sizes learn not to accept any type of abuse. My name is Clarice Precious Jones. I want to be on the cover of a magazine. After the screening was over, it was time to talk. And for these women, it was clear the film had a huge impact. It's hard to really come out with the truth. But that, that did actually happen to me. And it explained what really happened to me. And now I'm, I'm, I can go on with my life. It touched so much of me. Yeah. 
because me being, I've gone through a lot of abuse of myself verbally and stuff, and it's being said, and maybe that will start a whole lot of healing because people coming out, telling it. Hearing these women's painful stories brought a stunning revelation from China herself. Thank you so much because I think I made another decision just talking with you guys. A decision involving her painful childhood. The major and numerous pitfalls in my life has been my father being addicted to crack for a very long time. I was constantly chasing him and chasing a love that I wasn't finding. One of the decisions that I made up in my mind is that I have to start learning to forgive. If they can do it, I can do it. If Precious can do it, I can do it. Every once in a while, a little movie comes along, changing lives both on and off screen. With a message that matters, Precious continues to tug at America's heartstrings and now stands at the threshold of film's highest honor. Thank you for joining us on this special look at the story behind one of this year's most touching films, Precious. For TV Guide Network, I'm Tanika Ray. Bye.